What up, Nate? Rolling. We're going to get rolling in a minute here. I'm going to turn on Instagram Live for Eyes on bed So if you want to join in on that too, kick in some views there. That would be amazing. And then you can let me know on sound and video quality as well. My lovelies. Boomer, what's going on? What's happening today, friends? Um, today we're doing an eyewear presentation. We're going to do it on Instagram Live, too. So I'm going to be between here and here, here and here. So let me see if I can turn this on. And if you all want to join me on Instagram Live as well, if you feel like it. If you don't feel like it, it's cool. But if my attention splits, uh, that's why. I'm engaging with two different audiences. Or two of the same audiences, really, if you will. We did this once before. Oh my god. He's bags under my eyes. Right? So puffy. Mm. Let me hydrate already before Nate tells me to. How are y'all doing tonight? Can you hear me okay? Or is music too loud? Look at all those booties. I sound great here, okay. And will you give me feedback, Berlin, on Instagram Live too? Cause that's about to happen. Oh, I can put a title in? Well, shit. Walk cardio, so you try. Oh, that's okay. You do you. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> wow, I'm very pale on that camera. I mean, I'm pale in general. I already knew it, but all right. Nothing I can do about it. Let's see how this goes. And we are now live on Instagram as well as Twitch. So 
Hi, everybody. Thank you for tuning in already, my lovelies. I hope you're having a wonderful Monday. Happy Indigenous Day, right? It's Indigenous People's Day. And the only Christopher that we acknowledge is Wallace. Welcome, Brolin. Welcome. Welcome. The shirt, though, right? With those emotes. If you want to join us live on Twitch, feel free. The channel there is Ms. Soul Survivor. Um, so I'm Eyes on bed right? Um, music is louder here than on the stream. Great. Good to know. So that means my phone is a little bit uh, more sensitive. Uh, it's probably a unidirectional mic in the, uh, in the speaker and my mic here. Good old Blue Yeti is set up as omnidirectional, so it's only picking up basically this way. Um, yes, 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 yes. So welcome, welcome. This is all about eyewear tonight, right? Uh, until we finish presenting the eyewear, then we're going to get into a little bit of some gaming. Um, we'll probably do some Death Stranding finishing up because I realized I thought I finished the game, but I did not. And um, we have some very special eyewear collecting in that game. So let's start. We are presenting JF Ray eyewear all the way from France. Beautiful handmade materials. Featuring a very special collection that was designed and created uh, in collaboration with Hideo Kojima. If my title makes it sound like Hideo Kojima uh, is here with me today, no, he's not. But the eyewear is really cool. So we're going to get started presenting that. Thank you so much. Uh, JF Ray Eyewear sent that to me, so... Um, JF Ray, a little bit behind him, has a long history in eyewear design. I want to say at least like 40 years, maybe longer. Um, still independent, still family owned. It's the same uh, dude and people that started designing eyewear that long ago that's still involved with the design today. Beautiful, handmade in France with beautiful acetate and the paint. So. I didn't go too deep. I didn't do many acetate pieces. I did three because I have a lot of acetate. And what I wanted to present to you all, hey Sparky, was um, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Optics. Nice to see you. Um, what I wanted to um, focus on in JF Ray is a lot of their fun metals, right? Because everybody loves a metal frame. Acetate kind of gets all the glory in my collection. And I wanted to kind of spread the love a little bit. So we did some really fun, cool metal frames that are extremely lightweight, um, and you cannot describe these as boring, okay? So, uh, and where are my contacts today so I can actually see this time what's going on? Also, heart eyes, motherfuckers, everybody joining us, heart eyes for you. Okay, the first two I'm gonna present to you are acetate combo frames. I couldn't resist, I couldn't resist. But they're so friggin' cool. All right, look at this. All right, this is good for either men or women both. All right, you see my ring light in there. It's really, and yes, I'm always this pale. What can you do? Tony Brown collection, hello. So this is a really cool play on an aviator, right? It's a fun, I'm gonna get real close. If you don't mind, we're just gonna get real close for a second. Super lightweight. It's got this super cool kind of blue metal right there. You see that? This is going to be good. You can put your shirt on if you want, Sparky. This is, you're in the Blue Lip Sub Club, right? This is such a cool look. Again, this is going to suit anybody. And I say men or women, but of course I also mean like my non-binary friends. You know, this is like, I don't think of frames in terms of gender because they're frames, they're eyewear. You're not putting them on your genitalia. It has nothing to do with that. You wear what you love. You wear what you, what loves you back, right? This can be one of them. This is so pretty and it's so lightweight. The hinge design is fantastic. All right, beautifully made, beautifully handmade. I'm in love with it already. 
We also have it in additional color. For those that like the crystal. This is still a really kind of bold look, right? A lot of people think crystal means it's just gonna kind of fade in with whatever you're wearing. No, no. This is almost a bolder style, okay? Um, and it can, it'll pop on whatever skin tone you have. See, I'm pale as a fucking corpse, okay? Depending on what tones you got going on with here, right? I would do a little bit of a tint in the custom lens, which we can absolutely do for you here with at Eyes on Bed Style, right? Um, and you can kind of see the crystal is really cute. This has a gray, like a kind of grayish gunmetal, like a matte gray finish in here. I'm going to bring it real close for y'all so you can see. Bring it close to y'all too. We're working with two cameras and these beautiful temples. These are so comfortable. Hey, I am Nadine, how are you? Welcome, come on in, get yourself comfortable. We're looking at our brand new eyewear collection. It just landed today, and I'm so excited to present it to y'all. Like, so excited. So, Vex for that one, okay. Next up, this is another style, kind of like a, not your average rectangle, okay? If anybody knows me, the 90s did a terrible thing where everybody was wearing these like just thick ass rectangle frames. You know what I mean? And that worked for some people but not for everybody and it, it was a big fad that like it, we're over it now, okay? Now you can still do rectangles but you don't have to be boxy about it, okay? It shows. I'm glad my excitement is showing. Look at this beauty here, okay? still framed you Ooh, you know what i have many cat eyes i have maybe one or two in this collection coming up nadine but when i was selecting uh the frames for this line and i'm talking to two cameras so excuse me i'm also live on twitch and i'm live on instagram so my two audiences here um i'm a big gamer i live stream on twitch that's kind of my other thing not other thing because we're in conjunction here so the red in these are great. They're super lightweight, all right? You can accommodate most prescriptions in here. We'll talk about it depending on what your prescription is. We might not want to go too, too thick. Beautiful acetate temple. So the, the metal and the acetate together, what a beautiful combination. Very modern, very sleek. Loving this. And here's the alternate colorway. This one's gorgeous. This one's got like an aubergine and a navy blue. So it's gonna stand out a little more in these beautiful temples here. Let's see if we can get, this is a little bit of tortoise. A little bit of a play on a tortoise, right? See the blue lines down it? Might be harder to tell here, right? These are gorgeous. Now, how we work here at Eyes on Bed Stuff is, I'm, like, we start off with, like, a virtual consult, which we can do here on this, over Instagram or other video chat, whatever is comfortable with you. And we'll kind of narrow down what in the selection is going to work for you. Um, and then we'll do an in-person appointment. Either you come to my home office or I go to you, and we observe every COVID precaution. Because I'm careful. And I want to keep my uh, I want to keep my community members safe. Um, next up, this is going to be a larger fit frame, right? Because some of us we kind of got we're pretty wide right here. So this one's going to be super comfortable. This is a really really pretty. What color is it? The lights are actually kind of blinding me, but it's fine. Um, there's one. Oh, this is the ooh, red one. Look at the temples on here. Oh, you're in Florida? Well, that's okay. So, and you, do you know what? I just did, um, the other alternative is I put a little box together for you. We kind of work out a deposit. Uh, and I do a try on at home, send a box to you. You can, uh, I actually just did it with one of our community members here in, in Miss Soul Survivor. Um, and she lives in a whole other state. 
So I'm happy to do that. We can work stuff out. The beauty of working with someone that knows their collection, and that's an optician. I've been doing this for about 20 years, give or take. Um, so, is that I kind of got a real good idea of what's going to fit you right off the bat. You're in Florida as well? How's it down there, y'all? Are you warm still? Because it got cold today, and I'm like, oh. This is a lovely contrast. I'm going to bring it up here. So y'all can appreciate the details. It's still focused on me. How about that? And we're going to go down to this camera. Look at this. Not at me. Look at this. Now look back at me. Now back at this. By the way, the stickers came in. I am not too young for 20 years in the business. Um, we got our stickers available too. These are your gift, one of your little surprises that you all get with your purchase. Um, I'm actually uh, still 87 degrees. Wow. Nice. We hit, we're like mid 50s today. Um, here's the other color in this one. So it's a little bit more tame in the temple. Okay. But you see this beautiful red coming right through this acetate. No, 89 in Miami. Nice. Sparky, you know you're going to get a stick. Sparky's been a long time supporter of this stream. Sparky, you get a sticker. You'll get one of each color. Um, Zen Spice, hello, how are you? Welcome, Zen Spice is incredible. And they were one of the models in the recent fashion show that we did and killed it. I was like, y'all make my job super easy. Hello Vaporlink, how are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. This is a, the same style that we just showed, different colorway. So a little pop of red in here. The inside's lovely as well. We're gonna move on. You don't miss the cold? Oh, you're from the Bronx? You know what, I need to visit the Bronx because I hear they have a really good food scene there. Am I, am I wrong? Y'all have good food? Hey, Gogo Bari. How are you doing? Welcome. I bet you don't miss the cold, but I bet you miss like the access to all the fun stuff New York City has. I've been in New York about four years. I used to live in Boston. Don't judge me. But, and I, not that I hate Boston, but I just love Brooklyn so much more. All right. Next up in this metal connection, food, man. And you know what? Getting delivery at all times of night? Come on. I miss it. Look at this beauty. I don't have a round frame. Also, y'all might have to help me pick out one of these for me. Look at this. Beautiful play on a round, right? It doesn't look like a nerdy round. It's very modern, very fashion forward, extremely lightweight. Um, here's a little bit of the interplay with the metals. They're kind of give you an illusion of being woven into each other. And here's this for you all. We're showing off our eyewear today, Vapor Link. And I'm gonna hit you, I'll hit you with this link here. So if you wanna check there, you can find us on Instagram and Facebook as well. Um, these are incredible. I have these coming in in one under the color. Unfortunately, uh, there was some back order, which was kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. These are incredible. Shit. Red's not really my aura though, so we'll see. Um, next. Y'all, I'm so, oh, I do have the other color. I am so excited about the Death Stranding collection. I don't know if I want to save those for last. Round over, you can, you can wear round, anyone can wear round. Uh, Nadine, it's just finding the right round for you, all right? There's, like, not all rounds are equal, if that makes sense, right? You gotta find the one that works for you, works with your vibe, works with your personality. I have a super round face, and some people wanna be like, if you have a round face, don't wear round glasses. Forget that mess. Wear what you love, and wear what loves you back. And sometimes, like, uh, that's another thing that's working with me that I get a lot of feedback uh, is 
Wow, I never would have tried that on, but it looks amazing. So I will challenge you to try something and like I'll push you to something that you n normally wouldn't do. Because like as humans, right, and as people, our tendency is to kind of do the same thing, the same look over and over. It gets kind of stale after a while, especially with glasses when you're wearing them for like three, four years, am I right? So if you're trying to build a little bit of a collection, let's differentiate, let, you know what, diversify that portfolio of eyewear. Uh, do I design my own eyewear as well? I do not, Tony Brown Collection. Um, that is, n it, that's cooking for future eyes on bed -Stuy. but right now, I don't. I have, um, I got the ideas percolating, and I know exactly who I'm gonna work with when that time comes, and that time will come. And yes, I have the Death Stranding Collection that was designed uh, in partnership with Hideo Kojima. It's so amazing. Okay, ready? Here's the next round one. This is the same as the previous one, but look at this color. So white and red, some shades of gray, some candy stripes here on the inside. Seven pairs of cat eye progressive. Yeah, I really, I hear that Nadine. I, I'm the same way. I lean hard towards progressives. I love the stripe on the inside. Do y'all see this? Striped on the inside, striped on the outside. It's like red stripes here, and then on the inside, black and white stripes. This one here, let me find out for you real quick. Cause I didn't put them in my system yet to price them, so I might have to DM you afterwards. Uh, la, 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 la. But they're gonna be between like 375 and 425 is the area. Um, so I'll get you an exact number afterwards. Chef Butter, hey, welcome. I was just thinking about you because I was going to message you on Wednesday because I know you need some adjustments. So I got you if you are around. Okay. Next two in this collection. Look at this here. Just Jack, hello, what's going on? I was thinking about you, neighbor. Look at this. Again, but I'm always this pale. So if you have any, I'm translucent. If you have any sort of like, this will give you a good idea of what things look like. But let's say, oh my God, look at this color. Maybe I like this one for me. I don't know, y'all might have to help me decide. And here's the other colorway. This one's a little more subtle. Right, a little bit like eggplant, a little bit of aubergine, a little bit of blue, right? Look at this, the temples. We got a little blue in here. This one's like a, oh, oh. Oh, this one, this one might be the. I like this. The blue tones are hard to see on this side. Yeah, it's. You can see it a little bit better on the stream. And if you all want to join and give a follow on on um, on, chef, on Chef. Don't read and talk at the same time. You like this one? These are incredible. Just arriving in stock today. Like I said, I haven't even put them in the system yet. I was so excited this morning when I got that box. I was like, we're doing an Instagram Live. Oh, my hair is crazy. I got the COVID cut. All right. These next two are titanium beauties, right? These are going to be a little bit, again, on the wider side. Good for anybody. Kind of, an, again, a more interesting shape on a rectangle play. This is a beautiful green with like this blue stripe. Thank you for the link, Sparky. The temples are gonna be like, they're, these are acetate temples, but they're finished to kind of look like wood. So I'm gonna give you kind of an up close look here. 
The funny thing is, I, I had my hair cut by my stylist because he came here with his mask and like, you know, I got the hand sanitizer, I got the temperature gun coming. I even, if you don't want to take off your shoes, I got them little booties you could put over your shoes to come in here. And then I have a steamer. I take it very seriously. Um, but yeah, I was thinking of maybe letting it grow out. My hair kind of looks, it's a mess, but it looks great today. Those curls came out nice. Um, and here's the other color in this one. Again, you know, we can take your standard metal rectangle for a bigger face. My face is pretty big, but this is kind of XL, right? Um, and you can like level it up a little bit. This is a very light gray at the top, and you got this very like gorgeous navy blue. I know the camera keeps focusing on my face, which is nice when I'm not trying to show off eyewear again. And I'm going to show it to this camera, too. We got two cameras happening. Ooh. These are gorgeous. Titanium is super, super lightweight. And um, super durable. I'm excited about this. Thank you for stopping in, Tony. I appreciate you. And I'll see you real soon, I'm sure, on our next IG Live. Because we're going to do more of these. Okay. This is one of the ones. What's up, zombie dog? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Get yourself comfortable. This is one of the ones where I only have one of the pieces in. It's a white and black, or like kind of like a silver, like a brush silver. The contrast is fucking incredible. Um, I love this shape. I love like just it's the artistry. It's kind of oh, the design. Fuck this design. What plans for today, zombie dog, is showing off our eyewear for Eyes on Bed Style. Look at this. Oh my god. And then we're going to play some games after. Probably going to play Death Stranding because I did get the Death Stranding collection in and I'm super excited about that. Super excited. Alright. Here's a cat eye for Nadine. A play on a cat eye. But she wants round. But here's one that's like, I'm pretty sure she doesn't have a cat eye like this. This is incredible. The color, just the, the cutout. Wow, and the fit. You have a, do you have a cat eye like this, Nadine? This I have coming in more colors. This is like a very pretty red with a gunmetal behind it. So it's not going to be too flashy, right? It's super like, it's like a, I don't even want to call it classic because it's not that. This is all kinds of yes. Look at this. What's up, Splitter Side? How's it going? Hold it up here for y'all to see and then we'll come over here. What I should have done was taken the lenses out of all this so you can kind of see the um, the beauty of the frame, right? Without the um, without the reflections. This is gorgeous. This is a gorgeous piece. Let me find out for you, Nadine, because again, um, like this one, let's see. I don't think this one is titanium. Super lightweight. This will accommodate just about any prescription, too. This one's going to be closer to like 425, 450. It's kind of, yeah, the lenses are going to sit. So see how it's kind of like this? The lenses are going to, are beveled and they're going to be in this frame. Right? The top one. So depending on your prescription and how thick your frame is, or uh, your prescription is, uh, we'll go over the details with you, and I'll message you afterwards. What's up, Ultra Zach? How's it going? I got answers. If you got questions, let's see here. These are not blue light glasses, Ultra Zach. However, I can make blue light filtering lenses in just about any pair. 
Oh, just readers? Then we can do that for you, Nadine. Yeah, that's, those are simple. Like a plus two or a plus two and a quarter. Um, so, Ultrazac, I'm going to give you my links here. Um, I'm Eyes on bed and also Ms. Soul Survivor. I game, and I'm an optician of almost 20 years. Uh, so I make custom lenses, and these are the collection that I just got in, and we're getting to the Death Stranding collection. Um, this is gorgeous also, right? A little bit of, like, this beautiful plum with this gunmetal. So I can make you custom lenses in anything. 175, perfect. Yeah, these will accommodate that prescription really easy. Um, look at the fit of this one. Thank you for the follow. Heart eyes, motherfucker. Like the shirt says. <laughs> we appreciate you. These are gorgeous. I picked pretty much only all medals from the JF Ray collection because I didn't really have any cool medals and I had a really hard time finding cool medals. Um, I, I don't like boring frames. If you're shopping at Eyes on Bed's Diet, it's because you want something different. You want something leveled up. You want something off the beaten path. And that's what you come here for. You're also coming here so that you can have a veteran optician um, get you the best fit and the best lens solutions for your life. Because lenses are not one size fits all and frames are not one size fits all. This is not one of them, just pick what you like. No, 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 no. No. You're going to have a guide this way and again I'm gonna challenge you to kind of just go outside the lines of your comfort zone just a little bit this is beautiful I might maybe this one for me let's get up close this is amazing all right on to the next one I have this in three colors and I think I'm expecting it uh, in other colors we're gonna do it in the all gun metal first. Hey Silver, how you doing today? Uh, Nadine, this might be a good look for you because it's not round, right? We got all kinds of angles here. This is a beautiful fit too. Look, eyes are dead center. It's adjustable nose pads, so we can kind of make whatever work with it. It's very dynamic, right? I like this a lot. Damn. When I got my PC, I want to get blue light glasses. Don't need reading glasses, according to Dr. But I don't want to mess up my eyes. I hear that, Ultra Zach. Um, honestly, I have thoughts on blue light, okay? And I can let you know a little bit about that. Um, there are zero definitive studies um, that link exposure to blue light that comes from your monitors and your phones and other devices to anything really, really harmful. Um, the only thing it kind of can mess up is your circadian rhythm. But obviously, if you're in front of a screen or you're holding your phone, like we all do it. You know how when you're, you got your phone and you're like, scroll, scroll, scroll. And you're in bed and you're like scroll 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 and then you kind of drop it and hit yourself in the face if you have a light like here it's gonna keep you up usually acetate frame cat eye chunky this is really out of the comfort zone oh nadine well i'm glad we get to explore that with you um ultra zach what i would recommend for you is just a pair with a good anti-reflective treatment you know but if you really really want to do blue light right because you'll get more blue light exposure from the sun in just your regular day-to-day, -day, just please have UV in all your glasses, everybody. UV coat, UV coat, UV, UV all day long. Even on cloudy days, there's UV out there. UV is harmful, um, definitively so. Um, let's check the next color. So if you really wanna address blue light, we're gonna do blue tech lenses for you. And those are gonna be yellow because a yellow light is <coughs> That's me choking on uh, the sage incident that happened earlier. I burned some, uh, I lit the sage and it just kind of went um, Yeah, if you don't want to have your circadian rhythm mess messed up, don't, uh, you gotta turn off your computers and your screens. 
Did you mean 19 years old, Silver? That's hilarious. How are you today, my dear? Look at this. Oh, you meant time? Look at this. We got this beautiful... Field mouse, hello. We got this beautiful, like, red-orange color. I'm not gonna say blood orange, but it's, you know, a pretty kind of red. And this gold, this is gorgeous. Wow. There is a, these are fucking fantastic. I'm so excited about this collection. I don't know about you all, but I'm excited. One last color in that shape. I gotta take the lenses out. I love these. It does, but look at this. This is a rose gold with this pretty little mint color. Ooh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Which one should I get for me? I gotta rock one of them. Dang, look at this one. Oh, I'm so glad I got this collection. I was so excited. Okay. Last one. This is kind of like from the JFRA 1985 collection. I got it and I have it coming in a couple other colors. It's super cute. And then we're going to the Death Stranding collection. So, hold on to your butts. <laughs> now those, you know. All right. Look at this. You all know I like the weird shit, right? Jean-Philippe Jolie. Hello, designer of sunglasses. And beautiful uh, uh, frames as well. Optical. Optical. Ophthalmic. So, I got this one because it's kind of like whimsical, right? Kind of old school, funky. This is from the JFRA 1985 collection. How you doing? Like, you know what? Everyone needs a weird, fun pair of glasses, right? You can make readers out of these. You can make sunglasses. Again, like, really kind of... Did that just get louder? <laughs> it did. So, the <laughs> I love these. They're so unexpected. And this is just a really beautiful, simple black. Okay. Are y'all ready for the death stranding? Sunglasses chilling at the beach, that's right. Or sunglasses like nobody talked to me on the subway. All right, so we'll do the ophthalmic ones first. All right, all of these frames are named for the character who wore them in the game of death stranding. Um, Hideo Kojima, the developer of fabulous games such as Death Stranding, uh, Metal Gear Solid series, um, and probably some other stuff, I guess. I don't know. Um, uh, round like square. Can, <laughs> can I rock anything? I don't know. Maybe. I tried. So this one is called Cliff, okay? This is from Sad Mad Dad that was played by uh, Mick Mickelson in Death Stranding. Just going to be a very classic. You can make a reader out of this. Again, you can make a sunglass. In fact, I have it as a sunglass, so I'll show you both. Um, this one is understated, but so, so elegant at the same time. Not quite round. No, a little bit flat at the bottom. Smooth, sleek, look at the details here. And we'll show it to y'all too, again. Well, maybe let's pop the lenses on this one too. Good night, thank you for tuning in. I know you're on the other side of the world. Sleep well, Jean-Philippe. Bijoux, I know some French. <laughs> so, I wanna say, you look like you belong in the sci-fi or cyberpunk novel. You got anything for that? I do. 
Yeah, this is definitely like a slim line, you know? They're very chic. Here they are in the sunglass. <laughs> and you can see my reflection in the screen there. Mwah! These are great. And we'll get a little closer. It's just like straight, sleek, classic. This is the cliff. Again, played by Mick Mickelson in the game Death Stranding. Let's put these away. All right. Anime, I guess they have cool glasses in anime probably, maybe. Do y'all remember which character this came from that played the game with me in stream? He died every 21 minutes. <laughs> this is Hartman's glasses. Thumbs up. He always gave you a thumbs up. Well, that one time he gave you a thumbs down. He didn't like what you did. Kind of yoinked something out of his office. Um, beautiful detail here again. Okay. This one I can't really take the lenses out of because of the way it's mounted. Honestly, this is the one I was thinking for Gritty, personally. Where is Gritty? We should ping them. All right. So this kind of like almost side shield effect here is gorgeous. These are super lightweight again. And here you have the, um, mm -mm -mm. the bridges. Not me. It's not going to show it. The camera's like, what? That's the Bridges logo. Let's see if you can see it here. Nope. Still zooming in on me. Nope. These are super cool. They also come in as a sunglass as well. Of course, you could get transition lenses in anything that turn into a sunglass when you're out in UV. These are super cool. They change the whole mood of the frame. I love, love, love the details here in the sides. A sheet of paper, a cardboard you could behind, hold behind the glasses to trick the camera. Maybe, maybe you're right. I'm just not prepared for that. Mm. That was Hartman. Okay. Next we have, and I can't remember the actor who plays Hartman in the game. Whoops. But this is Dead Man. Guillermo, uh, Guillermo del Toro. This cool matte black, I like this too. They're super comfy. Hmm. These are also kind of more like a chill vibe, you know, on the chill side of things. A little bit no nonsense. You still got the Bridges logo on the side here, on the temple tip. Will that work if I just like, right, cover my face? <laughs> no, you gotta kind of go like this, huh? Nope. <laughs> so much for improvising. You can put a fun tint in this too. In the game, he did have one that was tinted. And here is the sunglass. Nice brown lens for contrast. Contrast to the black frame and also high contrast vision. When you're wearing brown lenses, uh, things that are lighter colored, white tends to pop right so people that like this type of lens are uh sportsmen really um people that play golf people that like to fish um because that way you can track where things are going a little bit better stuff like that these are great i'm i'm so happy i'm so happy okay i'm so happy do y'all remember what movie that was from Hey, Sam Bam. 
Ah, well, if you're looking for a new pair, you can follow one of those links. Um, that's going to bring you to my uh, Facebook and my Instagram and the website. So what happens is that I do not list most of my frames on my website. I very much believe that it should be a like a one-on-one -on -one consultation. Sorry, I'm like here and then I'm Instagram live. First I'm here, then I'm here, then I'm here, then I'm here. Um, I know my inventory really well. I've been doing this for almost 20 years. Um, and I know what works and what doesn't work. So I'm not going to bring out a pair of glasses that are going to be way too big for you. You know, or I'm not going to be, you know, way too small. We can absolutely work virtually. Uh, if you live in an area that I can get to and we kind of like, um, oh, I love how I like nicked myself. Great allergies. Um, we can, um, I didn't see your last message, zombie dog. I'm sorry. You said agreed with Sparky. That was the last message I saw. Um, and if you don't live in the area that I can get to, where we can like do an in-person consultation. We do have the ability to set up a um, classes try on at home kind of thing where I send you a few, you leave a deposit with me, I send you a few, and then we go from there. This is the pair, oddly enough, called Sam. This was designed, this is a Sam Bridges. Sam Strand, Sam Porter Bridges. Uh, this is his pair of glasses. I like the look it's very classic just very easy um but i love this kind of strip of metal along the top with the orange on here and then the temples too these feel so cool now a nice thing that works for these is these have adjustable nose pads on the inside not a lot of acetate frames do that's something custom that i can add to a lot of frames but this is great if you're someone that has a softer bridge, okay? A little bit flatter. Yeah, these are pretty fucking incredible. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I didn't see that. But if you send it to me in Discord, that'll be awesome because that way I can kind <clears> of <throat> get to it. It'll get lost in stream chat. So send it to me in Discord. Yeah, this matte black is kind of cool. Look, I can see double me. Super cool. It's kind. Of, it's a pretty dark lens too. I dig it. These are all available for purchase. If it's something that you love, um, screenshot it or like describe it. Get at me in the DMs. Send me a message either on Instagram or on on a, on a la 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 Discord. And we can talk about it. Last two. And then we're done and we're going to get in uh, with some games. Also love the adjustable bridge and then have a pair of sunglasses that just slid off. You know what? Adjustments are crucial. And good adjustments are crucial. Um, nine times out of ten, you can look up. If you're, if you're in New York, come see me. Come see me. Brooklyn, I got you. I'll take care of you. Uh, I mean, people come from the Bronx, you know. Um, perfect zombie dog. Thank you. Um, if you're not close to me, message me. I will help you find a reputable optician in your area that should be damn good at adjustments. Because a good adjustment is key. It can fix... Uh, you may be not seeing quite well. It can fix pain behind here. It can fix pain here. It can just fix sliding, general uncomfortableness. I mean, adjustments. I posted actually a picture in the Eyes on Bedstein Instagram. And I'm going to post it on Instagram at some point. But uh, ask me why adjustments are important. And I'll tell you with that picture. Okay. This is the last one. I actually did get one of these for me personally because I thought they were so fucking cool. And they're very on brand. This is the Skull Cliff pair. This is probably the most badass one in the collection. Or maybe I'm just like partial to skulls. You see we got some, uh, some bones here. You see we got some skulls here and here. 
We have this one in the bronze color. Who's gonna fuck with you wearing these? Tell me. Nobody. Nobody that knows better. Right? If you like a little bit of attitude. Mm-hmm. Mm and then here we have it in the gunmetal color. This is the color I got for me. Gray and gunmetal. One for y'all. And one for y'all here. And I'll bring it closer to camera so y'all can kind of see the detail. These are so fucking cool. Look at that. There it is. There it was. So that's going to do it. This is going to do it for our JFRA presentation that we have on Instagram Live and here on Twitch. I'm going to thank you all so much for hanging out with me. And we're going to change gears. We're going to play some games. If anyone on Instagram Live wants to come through and uh, hang out, play games with us, just chill, chat. I'm glad you enjoyed Berlin. You know, I like sharing stuff with y'all. Uh, what's up, the IRET? Um, then thank you so much, Sparky. I'm glad y'all enjoyed. We're going to do one once I get, actually, now that the, the IREP is here too. Um, once I get my complete <clears throat> second order of Leibach in New York in, we're going to do another one because um, I might be a little bit, they might be some of my favorites, but I love this here. Thank you for putting the link on there. Y'all can join us at twitch.tv forward slash Ms. Soul Survivor. Thank you so much. This is JF Ray Collection, and this is the um, the Death Stranding collaboration that was designed in partnership with Hideo Kojima, who developed the game Death Stranding. Um, so this is where my two loves collide, and they're going to collide hard, and it's going to be a big, beautiful, just, you know, supernova of energy where we have my gaming, you know, and then we have my eyewear, and it's going to be, eye size on this one is a 52, believe it or not. They're actually quite a nice fit. I don't know if you're, you, you're probably familiar with JF, right? I rep being in the eye in, uh, industry. I almost said eye injury. Don't be in that. <laughs> no. Um, they're so friggin' cool. So yes, I did get one of these for me. I'm probably gonna put my prescription in it because I, I hate wearing contacts. I wear contacts just so I could show y'all all, all the glasses. Um, and it's a really giving me a headache. So I'm gonna pause. I'm gonna end the live stream. So thank you all so much for hanging out with us. Again, you can join us on Twitch or you can just catch me on the next Instagram Live. I do intend to do these more often than I already do. But it's like every time it starts to be about this time, something happens or I like feel shitty or whatever. It's been a rough couple of weeks. It's been a rough month, let's be honest. But uh, we're getting back on track. Uh, stay tuned because we are going to have a trunk show that we'll probably do a little IG live or live stream from uh, in a couple weeks as well. Super excited to present eyewear to uh, the bed neighborhood and to everybody beyond, really. Um, the stones, um, them stones, man, they fuck me up good. Um, love y'all on IG. I will see y'all soon. All right. Mwah. Okay. And I'm going to download that video. Yep. And we're going to share it to IGTV. And what I'm going to do with you, my lovelies here is I'm going to put you on hold for a minute. I'm going to take out my contact lenses because I will, I am, I kind of already have a headache starting to get one. Um, I don't want one. Don't forget y'all. Plaster your neighborhoods. <laughs> um, and I, I think I might heat up something to eat and then we'll play a game. I'm not sure what game. I think I got a bug bite, like, right here. Who gets a bug bite right here? What the fuck? So annoying. Um, but I gotta do something this, to get rid of this headache. I took Excedrin already, and it, that's not helping yet. 
And then um, I gotta get all these frames neatly put away so that I can uh, get them into my system and all that jazz on um, on, let's see here. We'll do this. Uh, so I can get them put into my system and all that stuff. So y'all bear with me kindly. Oh, I have water. Thank you, Sparky. Um, and maybe we'll continue with Sims or maybe we'll figure something else. I'm not sure what. I really like these. But right here, right here, come on. It's like a button. Oh, I'm weird. Okay. Um, I'm going to keep this dry, this dry, the stream on and I'll be right back. And I got to figure, I got to figure out my game. I got to figure out my game. Berlin with the booty. Oh, and I got to change all of my sound and all that stuff. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to actually end the stream and we'll be back. Because I got to change everything so it comes through the headset. And if I don't, like, I have to end the stream any anyway to fix it. So we'll be back shortly. Thank you. Love you. Bye.